Okay. It's time for our news. Students, you need to make up any NGs before the end of the year. Come, Come to, to Beauty, Beauty and, and the Beast. Beast, April 25th through May 3rd. Price is $8 for adults, $5 for students, and $30 for a family. Printcom is making an additional yearbook insert that covers events that aren't in the yearbook. It will be a bit available for less than $5 at the yearbook stop. All library books need to be turned into Miss Hutton, or you'll have to pay a fine. Middle schoolers interested in participating in next year's Shakespeare competition need to prepare a one to two minute monologue and be here next week at the school on Wednesday and Friday. If you want to play fall sports next year, you have to have a 2.0 this term. Printcom is looking for another sophomore and junior to join the team. Talk to Miss Gerber if you're interested. It's time for our pride. Jan's meeting. Jan is a cool person because he's Jan. He's always really nice, he's really outgoing. It's pretty much all about studying in Germany and here it's like people had a lot of have a lot of fun too. He always likes to do stuff. He's not one of those people that likes to just sit down and be sedentary. We get along pretty well. We both can relate with each other each other because um, we both have a European background and so we always talk about stuff in Europe. He is a wonderful student. He's always very polite and courteous. People are really friendly here. In Germany, sometimes when you go to random people, they're not that open. He always has like really funny things to say, and I guess he doesn't always do it very purposely, so yeah, I just love you on. I really love history. It's, I don't know, it's really interesting. I don't know. I don't even know why. He works really, really hard, and he has a good attitude. He's always really positive. And his classmates love him. He's, he's good at tennis. <laughs> <laughs> he's not usually a very loud and aggressive type of person, at least not in class. But you get him on the tennis court, and he is one mean beast. I play tennis on the major team, and it's pretty fun. He learns things and makes connections with his own native language that he never noticed before. I want to be a lawyer. I love Jan in general. He's like so awesome. He's really funny and he's really smart. My and smart. favorite type of food, food probably is German blood sausage. It's awesome. It tastes really good. And I kind of miss it. You don't have to go back to Germany if you don't want to. <laughs> uh, he's very energetic and he's a friend to everyone. He has this weird obsession over the word ah uh He -uh. means poop in German. <laughs> Jan's also a very hard worker and he cares a lot about what he does and it's just fun to be around and he always makes everyone feel welcome. Jan eats fast food every day. One day he's gonna be fat, but today is not that day. <laughs> well, he usually smells really good. He's just a good all around person. He's good at pretty much anything I've seen him do. And he's got a cool name that I can't say. Oh, a lot of people pronounce my last name wrong. Schmoops. Schmiding. Schmiding, Schmiding, Schmiding. Schmiddleheim. Schmiddling? I don't know. And Schmiding. Schmiddling? Schmiddling. Jan Schmiddling. Bye, Razor. See you next time.